Leon, welcome back to Wigan Athletic. We don't say that very often to, to our signings, but welcome back to Wigan Athletic. New environment from the last time you were here, but I suppose you're excited to, to get going and we know what you're all about, goals in the Championship. Yeah, um, obviously really excited to uh, be back. Um, there's a few familiar faces from when I was here before um, in terms of staff-wise and I know a couple of the players, which will help me settle in well. You've got great experience in this division and the manager already has brought in players like Anthony Pilkington and, and Danny Fox. That must excite you as well that the, the squad is built around having some really good experienced championship players. Yeah, I think it, um, it helps only in the championship to have some um, experienced players that have played at this level. Um, the manager's obviously made two other signings um, that have experienced at this level and um, hopefully I can add to that as well. When you came into the club in 2015, obviously it was a, it was a difficult time and, and the team was, was finding it tough around then. But since then, you've, you've really got a great record goal scoring in this, in this division, particularly last season with Sheffield United. Yeah, um, when I was here um, before, um, it, was, it was tough. Um, the team was lingering at the wrong end of the table and um, there was a quick turnaround in terms of uh, management. Um, and it was disappointing what happened. Um, but that, since then, obviously, I've been at Sheffield United and last season things went well for me and the team did really well. You've scored a great variety of goals since you've been at Sheffield United when you watch back over those goals you scored last season and the three you've got this season. What Would you say that even towards your, your mid-30s, you've developed your game even more since you've been at Sheffield United, arriving back at Latics? Yeah, well, I think um, it was for, last, for myself last season, it was just a run of games and... Um, being trusted to play every week and to uh, help team score goals um, helped um, some of the players that I played with at Sheffield United made my life a lot easier as well. Um, there's some good players there, and um, so it was. It was. I found it quite easy at times, and it was just a case of putting myself in the right positions and um, finishing the chances. Really, you were involved in the game against Latics at Bramall Lane. You you'll know what this team's about and what the manager's about, what's he said to you? Um, we had a little chat when I came in um, today, um, just about trying to help the team, try and score goals, um, try and lead the line with the other strikers, um, and just to work hard and when given an opportunity to take it, really. A lot of the Sheffield United fans have said a lot of nice things about you, You know how hard you work, the goals that you score. Have you got a message for them on, on leaving them and coming here? No, obviously, from... The first day that I arrived at Sheffield United, um, there was a bit of um, uncertainty about me going there, being an ex-Sheffield Wednesday player. But once the fans um, brought into me being there, um, there'd been nothing but fantastic to me. Every game that I played there, they would always be singing and shouting and encouraging the team and myself. Um, so I'd like to say thank you to them. And what would your message be to, to Latics fans? Because I suppose... Going back to that, that 15 season, you, you say yourself that it was difficult. I suppose you've got a point to prove as well. Yeah, always with me. <laughs> it's a, it feels like I have a point to prove. Um, I had a point to prove when I went to Sheffield United. I had a point to prove when I came here. and I've got a point to prove again. And it's just it's down to me to try and hit the ground running straight away and then prove to people again that I, I'm good enough to play at this level and I can score goals.